The best of the morning X. 99X. Mystery date. Are you ready for it's that mystery date? Don't be late. Be sure. Open the door. It's your mystery date. Here we go. Let's strike up the band. One, two, three. Come on. Wow. So tough. <laughs> Today, it's swingers hooked up. All the names have been changed to protect the innocent swingers of our society. You'll meet them, and you'll be quite surprised when you hear who one of the swingers is. All right. Today, our lead swingers. Now, keep in mind, this will be uh, very high traffic because there will be two people in each lane. Yeah, so those two people will work on They'll decide on their answer, and then the man will be responsible for giving the answer. So we're not confused on who's giving what. So they'll talk about it, and they'll give us an answer, and then we'll pair it up with our main swinging couple. Let's meet that swinging couple right now, baby. All right, Lars and Irene, welcome to the show, swingers. Hello. 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 Hey, guys, tell us about yourselves, besides the fact that you're swingers. Hmm, well, what do you want to know? Are you married? Uh, how about, are you just together? Yeah. Or are, you, are you a No, we're married. You're okay. married? How long have you been swingers? About three years. And did you realize you were swingers after you got married, or were you swingers and then got together? I was a swinger before we got together. And you converted her over? Yeah. It just kind of happened. H- how did you How did you bring her into that lifestyle? I mean, yeah, how, how does, does that, that just ca- kind of <laughs> happen? <laughs> yeah. I mean, I'm just curious how that, how that works. Well, it happened uh, kind of quite by accident. <laughs> we were watching TV, and uh, uh, they were doing a profile of a swing club out in Texas. And I looked over at... Uh, my husband and I said, oh, I bet you want to do something like that. And, of course, he jumped on it with... Hell yeah! Hell yeah! (laughs) Hell yeah! (laughs) And what did you say? I said, I'm willing. And did you... But did you know, Irene, that Lars was a swinger before? No. Okay. So that first time had to be pretty sketchy and scary for you. Yes, it was. I mean... Because none of us here, I think I can speak for all of us, we're not swingers. Uh, So... Thank you. I couldn't tell you what... You know what? What happens? Oh, wait a second! <laughs> there, one person stayed <laughs> silent. What? Yeah. Okay. <laughs> uh, so, no, so no, what? No. W- what happens? Like you, you find the couple you're going to swing with, and is there some kind of, you know, code where it, like does somebody go first, or do you go at the same time, or do you, what? What happens? Well, there's not any kind of code. I mean, if you get along, you get along. And you mm-hmm. say, I hey, mean, mo- most most of uh, who we party with are old friends. That is yeah. just too weird. Yeah. I mean, just, you're hanging out with your friends. You know what? I think I'm going to wife tonight. What is... Uh, I mean, it's just... Yeah, well, I mean, it's, well, let me, what, hey, pass the potatoes, by the way. Can I wife? <laughs> pass yeah, the, it's, yeah, pass it's, the potatoes and your wife. Uh, Irene, mm-hmm. what... The first time that you saw Lars uh, with another woman mm-hmm. in front of you, what was that like for you? I was kind of weird. You had to feel jealousy. A little bit, not a lot. Um, we were there to have fun, and and I was having fun being uh, an adventurer. And so, uh, what does that mean? Is that is that is that code for something? Were you just watching? I'm sorry. You're being an adventurer. Were you just like watching, or were you already in the act with the other guy? Um, I was the first time just watching, and then as I was watching, you know. Uh, some people came over and we started talking and I hit it off with them and so we started. So mm-hmm. you can, I'm guessing then that you uh, are maybe differ from most women in that you can separate sex from love. Yeah. And t- uh, you, well, in this lifestyle, you have to have first a strong relationship between you and your husband. I would think so. Yeah. And um, I mean, swinging is just an open license to whatever you feel like. Well, continue what you're saying, and what else? <laughs> um, you have to have that, uh, you know, a good relationship with your husband. Um, a little bit of jealousy at first will play into it, but once you um, talk to other people and you know get started, so to speak. And I hate to say that way, but mm-hmm. um, you know, it, it try it. It's it goes away. Wow. You not you you can't be quite that jealous because. It will screw everything up. Like, let's say in the course of a month, how often will you get together with other couples? Oh, maybe once, twice. 
So and just every now and then kind of thing. Just like yeah, you dinner it, with some buddies. Not every single day do or you guys every have, weekend. Do you have children? No. Are there any clubs that maybe we don't know about oh, in Atlanta yeah. that specialize in this? They've all come out of the woodwork. That's how, I mean. Uh, there's several clubs. We don't really care for them too much, though. Name, what, what are some of the clubs where it's swingers? Let's plug them. Mm. The what? Velvet Heaven. Uh, the Velvet, Velvet Heaven, Heaven is one. Velvet Heaven? What's that? Where's that? Over off of Cheshire Bridge Road. And f- the, and people the, just go in there and hang out, and they just... And everybody knows they, everybody there is a swinger. A swinger, and they yeah. just go... Okay. Oh. And, mean, okay, uh, <laughs> what, uh, our salespeople are listening. Velvet Heaven, who's got that account? Um, <laughs> should we have them just quickly describe themselves, Sure, Barnes? yeah. What do you guys look like? Start with you, um, Lars. Um... Uh, Pretty average, uh, about five nine, uh, clean shaven, corporate looking dude. Yeah. All right, Irene. Um, I'm five six, about um, 140 pounds, and uh, I'm a very um, athletic person. Okay. Now let's meet the couples. All right, couple number one is. These are all fake names, of course. Jeremy and Stephanie. Hey guys. Hey, how's it going? Good. Welcome. How long you been swinging? Uh, well, we've been swinging now. together for about a year, right? Uh huh. Sure. So now you guys aren't married. No. Yeah. No, you just, just been together your... about it. You've been together about a year. Yeah. A year last Monday. So Are now, guys... Jeremy, we we need them to uh, describe yeah. themselves. Jeremy, what do you look like? I have blonde hair, blue eyes. I'm about five eight, one fifty. Stephanie, okay. um, I'm about five seven, 120 pounds. Uh, blue eyes, curly red hair down on my shoulders. All right, couple number two is Brad and Brenda, and they're together right here. Hey, guys. Hey, guys. Brad and Brenda. Married? How's it going this morning? Are you guys married or not? Yes, oh, yeah. we are. Okay, you're married. You've been swinging for uh, your entire married career, or? No. Oh, no. We've only been swinging for about a year. About a year little and over a half. year. Do you have friends who know you swing who are not swingers themselves? Um, no, not really. No. We kind of keep it very uh, discreet. Did you discover this together, or were you swingers before you got married separately? No, together. Discovered it together. This is a thing we we explored, I mean, years after we've been married. How do you know when you're with another couple? How do you ask if they're swingers? Secret handshake. Is there a secret sticker on your car? No, we we meet people through, like uh, Jeremy was talking about, through the various clubs, Sesso, Utopia. Can I ask why you guys decided to become swingers? Because we're perverted. <laughs> we're perverted. perverted. Hey. There's an honest, uh, seriously. I mean, is it, let me ask you: Is it just because like having sex with the same person all the time is boring? No. Of course. Not at all. In fact, our Sorry. sex life is the best it's ever been. It was, it's, it was always good, but it's even more enhanced now. Brad, uh, what do you look like? Give us your stats. I'm six four. I weigh one ninety five. Um, work out in the gym every single day. So. Gorgeous. Yeah. Brenda, brown hair, selling um, it. Brown hair, hazel eyes. And how about you, Brenda? Well, I'm a petite woman. I have red hair, and I work out in the gym also. I'm not going to tell you my weight, but I, I fit into a size four. Size four? You're petite, yeah, okay. Yeah. How tall? I'm five foot four. Five okay. Four. Mm-hmm. All Good right, then. You. you guys hang tight. Need you to both to speak up a little more than you are, and then, uh, Brad, you'll be the one giving us the answer. Okay, Sounds now. Good. Interesting scenario in lane three. Let's meet Kathy first. Hey, Kathy. Hello. Kathy is, uh, Kathy's a hot potato. <laughs> really? Kathy, Kathy came through the casting call um, alone, and, and it was sad, and I was able to pair her up with another person who was willing to swing okay. on the other side. I'll introduce you to her partner. <laughs> Crash Clark, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> How you doing? <laughs> All right. Oh, my. How you doing? He's taking one for the team there. So Kathy and Crash are swinging couple number three. How you doing, Kathy? I'm doing just fine. So Kathy and Crash. All right, (laughs) Lars and Irene, welcome back. All right. All right, here we go. So we're going to throw these uh, scenarios out, questions out, and we'll start with couple number one, Jeremy Stephanie, then go to Brad and Brenda, then Crash and Kathy, and then we'll move on and get Lars and Irene's answer, which they've already answered off camera. (laughs) Foursome. Or Morsome. Ooh. We'll start with Stephanie Ooh. and Jeremy. What do you think, babe? I don't know. We usually keep it in the smaller groups. No, I say for, Foursome, right, PK? Yeah. All right, yeah. Foursome it is. Brendan, Brad? Well, um, we were talking about it off camera here. We think that uh, we like to get together with Morsome, uh, very selective couples and attractive couples, so the more the better. All okay. right, Morsome and Kathy and Crash, talk it out. 
Kathy, we're kind of new at this. What do you? Oh, <laughs> definitely more some. <laughs> <laughs> Kathy, I'm open minded. We'll go more some. Okay. Yay! All right, Lars and Irene, what's it gonna be? Foursome. Foursome. Oh, okay, Stephanie Jeremy. and Jeremy are one step to the bedroom. <laughs> All right, here we go. Home party or club party? Stephanie mm. and Jeremy. Uh, we usually have after parties at the house. Yeah, after parties are our thing, so home party. All us. right, let's go to Brendan Brad. Nice and loud, guys. Brendan Brad, we can barely hear you too. Okay, well, we really uh, we love to go to the clubs, but the best times do happen at home, so we have a lot of good home parties. All right, you cool with that, Brenda? Yes, oh, uh, yes, definitely. Ka- Kathy, crash. Kathy? I'm definitely with the home parties. Yeah, I, I yeah, I'm gonna have to also agree with Kathy on that one. I wanna keep I wanna keep it at the crib. All right, Lars and Irene. Home. home All right, party. everybody's yeah. on the board now. Yeah. 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 Everybody's on the headboard. Yeah. Nobody goes to <laughs> <laughs> Nobody goes to Velvet Heaven anymore. <laughs> <laughs> All right, Stephanie and Jeremy are closer to the bed with two. Brenda and Brad one, Kathy and Crash with one. Foreplay. A six pack or a massage? Hmm. Stephanie and Jeremy. Massage, definitely. All right, massage is going to be Brenda and Brad. It's got to be a massage. All righty. Kathy, crash. <laughs> definitely a massage. Oh, man, what happened to the six, <laughs> man? Come on. Can't swing unless I'm quarter loaded. <laughs> so what's it going to be? What's it going to be? Kathy, since uh, since I'm such an agreeable swinger, oh. we'll, we'll, and I'm a good massage therapist, we'll do the massage. Oh, awesome. Lars, Irene? Massage it is. Oh, there we oh, go. Everybody's on the board again. <laughs> everybody's uh, Stephanie and Jeremy, though, have that lead. First one to seven, you're going to win. How do you tell another couple that you're not interested? Come out and say it? Or do you lie, you lie to them and say, uh, maybe some other time? Come out and say it. Honesty is always the best policy. That's Jeremy, right? Yeah. yeah. Come out okay. and say it. Come out and say it. All right. Brenda and Brad? Well, we'd actually just come out and say, hey, we're not interested, and uh, good luck on your search. All right, come out and say it. Kathy, crash. Do you let them down easily, or do you tell them boldly? Uh, you tell them boldly. Communication's yeah. important. Okay. Yeah. All right, Lars, Irene? Honesty is always the best policy. Right. Look at you people. You're all on a roll. Four with Stephanie and Jeremy. Three both to Brendan, Brad, Kathy, and Crash. Your perfect evening. Quiet with a hot tub, a bottle of wine, and titillating conversation. Or loud, throbbing music, late night dinner on the town, then plenty of throwing down. Oh, man. Stephanie, Jeremy? What do you, what do you think? I think the second one. Me too. <laughs> oh, yeah. boy. Loud and throbbing, oh, okay? Yeah. yeah. Brenda, Brad? We like them both. I, know. I mean, God, it's such a hard choice because we love the hot tub, and there's nothing better than to get a hot, steamy couple in the hot tub. You want to say hot tub? Yeah, let's do hot tub. We're going to say hot tub, do it. Hot tub, <laughs> do it. No. <laughs> That's the, the swingers. Hot tub, do it. <laughs> Kathy Crash? I, I like the throbbing music and throwing down. Oh, my Crash, God. Crash, what's it going to be? Throbbing and throwing down? Can we take a break and let me talk to Kathy for a minute? <laughs> I'm getting a little flustered, though. You know what, Kathy? I've been doing it ever since I came to town. I've been throwing down. <laughs> <laughs> All right, Lars and Irene. We love hot tubs. Oh, oh no. <laughs> so now, look at that. We have a tie. We have Brenda and Brad, Stephanie, Jeremy, both with four. Kathy and Crash in the tail with three. We, we carry on. Getting down to business. Same room or separate room? Oh. Stephanie and Jeremy. What you think, babe? Same. Same room, yeah. You like to see what's going on? Oh, yeah. All right, Brenda and Brad? Oh, definitely the same room. We love to see each other, and it's just such a big turn on, right? Absolutely. Wow. <laughs> All four of us just shut up for a second. Uh, okay. we, we, we need to digest that. Drop trowel for a second. <laughs> Kathy, <laughs> oh, <laughs> Kathy and Crash. I'm gonna say same room. Yeah, you know, I, I wouldn't mind watching. Uh, yeah, it's all good. All right, Lars, Irene, <laughs> it's all good. Couples that play together stay together. Same oh, room. Yeah. Uh, if it pleases the court, I have a uh, brief line of questioning here. <laughs> When we talk about same room, are we talking about still, are we talking about like uh, everybody on everybody? Are we talking no, about no, 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 two no. on ones? Are, are we talking about, I mean, is it what? It's, it's mostly, it, guys are usually straight in this, but the women are bi. Oh, how you do it. 
it, what usually happens is, uh, and I don't know with everybody else here, but uh, usually with us, the, the ladies get to play a little bit first before the guys are sold. <laughs> Oh, oh wow. That's why same room is good. All right. So it's yeah. kind of your viewing. I think viewing. Jimmy has more questions. <laughs> but I, but so the guys never, You're looking no, the, confused. So the guys never do touch each other. Oh, no. no. Will there ever be two on one, like both women on one guy? Yeah. Oh, yeah. yeah. As, uh, as, as well as two men on one women, oh, one woman. All right. Okay, all right. <laughs> I'll stop it. All right, let's carry on. Soft swing or full swing? Huh? Huh? Mm? What? What does that mean? We like, uh, we like to go all the way. Full yeah. swing is where you do pretty much everything with another couple uh, that you would do with your normal partner. Soft swing is mainly just like kissy, kissing, kissy. touching, and stuff uh, like that. All right, you've been doing your homework. Hey, oh, if yeah. I'm gonna host He's swingers hooked up, you need you know the jargon. Come on, so is it gonna be Living full here. swing? You're taking full. Yeah, full. Okay, Brendan, Brad. Well, we think that uh, full swing is definitely the, the way to go. Kathy, crash. Oh, full swing. Yeah, if I'm gonna <laughs> insert myself into this industry, I'm going full. <laughs> All right, and Lars, Irene. Full. Uh, oh, yeah. Full swing man. ahead. All right, we've got All six right. and six for uh, Jeremy, Boy, Stephanie, man, Brad, and Brenda. Right Kathy, and Cra- Kathy and Crash have five. I hate to I hate to break this news, but that has just eliminated Crash and Kathy. Oh, oh no. because we have a tie for I'm Kathy. Not, hold on, shut up, Barnes. Just, okay. You just hold on. Well, that's what I was going to say. Is I'm not going to hang up on you. I'm going to do Crash a favor and put you on hold. Okay, great. Thanks. It was yeah. Nice to meet you. Thank you for playing. Bye, Kathy. Same here. A G A G E. It's not a factor. It's a big factor. Mm. Stephanie and Jeremy. Um. Well, I have an 18-year-old girlfriend, so I'd probably have to say that's not a factor. <laughs> All right. Brenda and Brad? Oh, this is a hard one, because um, age is a state of mind. Um, uh, yeah. We think it is a factor. And but it's not that big of a factor. It's not that big of a factor, but it is a factor when you're, when you're um, in different generations, kind of like Jeremy. Uh, uh, not a factor. Not a factor. All right. They say it's not a factor. Lars and Irene? It's not, not a, factor. a factor. That'll keep you in the game, Brenda and Brad. <laughs> These are very good questions. At the party, same gender swinging. I don't think so, or I would hope so. Mm. Stephanie uh, with, and Jeremy. With males what? or females? Uh, whatever. <laughs> you have to be more specific with that one. With any, you got to be specific with, with that one. With, with males or females? With either gender. No way. Well, yeah, well, no way. Hang on, guys. One at a time. Stephanie and Jeremy first. Yeah. Uh, if, 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 if we got to have both, then I'd rather not have any. But uh, it's just the I'm ladies. Not, I'm not saying both. I'm saying just same gender. <laughs> that could be either just the ladies, just the guys, or right. both. It's The question is, does that, you know, would you want that to happen in any of those forms? <laughs> mm, sure. <laughs> I, I don't know. <laughs> is it Stephanie saying sure? I, I'm gonna. I'll go with her on this one. Yeah. Well, yeah. Like, I mean, I don't want to see guys together, but right, and that's not if, what I'm saying. But if I can close my eyes and look over at the girls, then that's fine. <laughs> so, so you're saying I would hope so? Yeah. Yes. All right, Brenda and Brad. Well, for me, I definitely would like to have that, but um, not for Bill. So I guess we would say. I mean. <laughs> I, guess Whoops. Was, I, mean, <laughs> I don't really think that. You made it all the way to the last question. Uh, so is it, I don't think so, or I would hope so? Oh, God, I would hope so. All right, and Lars and Irene? I don't think so. Oh. Wow. Now, what does that mean? <laughs> so now on. we have a complete tie. We have a complete tie. Oh. No <laughs> more questions. We have to come nope. up with another question. So, well, are we send them all out together. It's just a tie. They all go to dinner, and they work it out. I don't hey, think that's swingers. a problem. Yeah, they're swingers. No, I mean, that, that's what you live for. So the only person gets left out of this is Crash. <laughs> <laughs> Crash gets left out of the mix. Is that, is that okay with you guys? Yeah. Fine with that. Can All we right. bring them along? Uh, Crash, you sure? I'm you sure. want to? We'd love to have more. Yeah, bring Crash and Kathy. That well, sounds hey, like a plan. Why'd we play the game? <laughs> yeah, really? We just played the, <laughs> spent a half hour just to... To get to yes, that no, we're going to send everybody out together, but yeah, we want an update. No, I, I yeah, think you hang on. Yeah. We, we definitely need a hooked update off of this one. Can we tape this dinner? Uh, if you want to go and sit through that. 
You, well, we could send Crash. Go right ahead. All right, everybody, hang on. You know, you know what? You don't want to bring Crash. The guy's never done anything like this before. He doesn't he, even know the girl. He's just jumping in. Yeah, he's just yeah, yeah. Swingers hooked up. The best of the morning X. Ninety nine X.